Hi, my name is France Morissette from Beyond the Peel. Thanks for joining me. I wrote about the fire tower secret just very recently and I had a few things I'd like to add. And I will be adding a few more components to that over the course of the next week. So stay tuned. So today I wanted to talk to you about a topic that uh, all of you know probably quite a bit about maybe even more so than I. However, I would bet money on it that very few of you are actually doing it. Um, we have mindful eating and portion control. Ugh, I know, portion control, it's automatically associated with you know, measuring everything you eat. However, that's not a real problem solver for the long term. No one's gonna go to a restaurant and measure their food. No one's gonna measure their food in their kitchen for the rest of their life and their existence. So what is it that we're actually talking about when we're talking about portion control? This is a tip some of you already know about and some of this might be new to you, but this worked for me and I think that it is a real big solution, long-term solution. So plate sizes, let's just talk about that. This is a salad plate that came into our little uh, packaging you know, when you buy sets. So this is the salad plate and this is the size plate that I eat on and the reason I have chosen this one is it's the size of my hand, open hand. That's the right size. No matter how hard I try, I'm not going to be able to get more than two cups of food on this plate. Maybe three if I really pile it high with lettuce or something. But that's about the right size plate for me. My husband um, eats on a big size dinner plate. This is what most of us are using today. So you can see the tremendous difference between those two. Now, he can of course eat more than I do. He has denser muscle tissue. He's taller. He's male. He's got all these other components that are going on and he's a lot more physically active than I am. Um, you know, being in the ski industry, he may be on his skis for eight hours. That's a huge difference in um, our metabolism. So, this is the other one we also eat on and you're thinking, well, how is it really that different from this? Well, there's a good inch um, border around this entire plate, so the center is still only the size of my hand, and that helps me really control how much food I'm eating um, at every meal, and I think that's really helpful. Now, the other part of that is mindful eating. Um, you may ask yourself, what is mindful eating? I'm only going to share with you a few of those components. Uh, there are a lot of great books out there that actually will go into it in depth and... Um, really great helpful tips. However, mindful eating, what I'd like to talk to you about is just slowing down, really tasting every bite, taking a full 20 minutes to half an hour to actually eat your meal. It doesn't mean putting together a peanut butter jam sandwich and running out the door. And sometimes that's the reality, but we need to actually slow down. And that was a big thing that we learned when we lived out in the middle of nowhere is that we actually had to force ourselves to slow down and now we're implementing that into our busy lives to just stop, take a moment, taste every bite, savor everything and if you love food as much as I do, really give that food attention by giving it time to develop in your mouth as you chew it, really taste it and that's when the quality of food that you're eating is really going to take on a different life because now you're actually tasting it instead of just having it go into your body to be some type of instant fuel. So try that. I want you guys to implement these things into your life. Start today and I'd love to get some feedback from you. So we're going to do a little contest. Everyone who enters a comment, some information on the blog will be entered for a special prize. So over the next week, please add your comments, make your suggestions. We'd love to hear from you. And the next video that we're gonna be um, talking about is ridding yourself of the addiction of convenience foods. So stay tuned and we'll see you in a couple of days.